So with Mark Doyle here in the airport after last night's 2-1 defeat in Luxembourg, Mark got our goal in the 93rd minute. Your thoughts on the game overall? Yeah, I think uh, we probably didn't show uh, the best of ourselves uh, last night. Um, but obviously good to get the goal because it keeps us right in the tie and hopefully um, now next week with the home crowd behind us we can, uh, we can really kick on and uh, hopefully we can, we can go through. Yeah, your first European goal, what do you remember about it? Uh, yeah, I just think... Uh, I remember who took the throw. I think Sam, Sam took it yeah. to, yeah. And then Tommy kind of just found himself in a bit of space and just uh, fired it across. And then I think the centre half took a bit long to clear it, so I just kind of pressed him and uh, thankfully nicked it off him. So, um, and then yeah, just just finished from there. Great feeling in front of the Pats fans that end as well. Yeah, it was classic. It was, it was kind of just uh, glad, obviously, to to score to because it kind of helps us now next week um, and it will give us a give us a good chance in the game and um, obviously. Uh, Score in front of the fans is class, and it's always a great feeling. And um, the fact they've travelled here and in their numbers and everything is just it's deadly. So um, you know the atmosphere all last night came from only them. You know, so it was great. In terms of important goals that you've scored across your career, that's got to be up there given the context of the game, going from two 0 down, going into the second leg to be within one goal. Yeah, definitely. Um, hopefully next week now. Uh, um, it will count for something, and, and we will and we will go through, and it will be a big contribution. Um, but yeah, um, it'll only be really be important once we go through. From chatting to John last night, he was saying it was very difficult for, for you guys and the staff to get eyes on, on them because they were in pre-season, even in terms of video. So having been able to play them, see them live, and, and have video of the game as well, that'll have to help in, in preparation for next week. Yeah, definitely. I think. Um, Obviously, as as the gaffer said, they they were in pre-season. We had a couple of clips, and then we had some clips from last year. But they changed manager and players moved on, and um, they're pl playing obviously in a different way. But um, obviously, the gaffer and Johnny and Graham will all have a look now at uh, at the video, and um, I think we'll be much more prepared now next week because we'll have played against them, and we know kind of where the threats are and how they like to play. And a full week to prepare now as well. Back to Richmond next Thursday, sold out, two and a half thousand, albeit, but place will still be as full as it can be. Our record at home this season has been very good. It's the best in the Premier Division and hopefully we can come out on the right side and get through to the next round. Touchwood. Yeah, 100%. I think uh, it's a bit of a shame that the, there's no standing in Europe. It'd um, be great to have it have a full as it has been for nearly every league game, you know. So, um, But yeah, no, can't wait now. Um, I think we all just have to uh, focus this week now in training and uh, yeah, it'll be a good atmosphere and um, I know the fans will give us a boost and hopefully, you know, they won't like coming to us and playing there. Cheers, Rick. No, what about?